Hello, hello everyone, welcome back. On today's video, I'm gonna show you how I made four red buffalo plate Christmas decor. The first project that I'm gonna show you is this tabletop wooden Christmas tree. The materials I got at our local 99 store. The first step that I did is I painted the wood tree with this um, color. I think it's red apple from Apple Barrel. I found this um, buffalo plate duct tape. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cover the strips of the wooden tree with this um, duct tape. Next what I'm gonna do is I have here these tags that I also got at our local 99 store. And all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna glue them to the strips on the wooden tree. So the first strip, the, the one that goes on the top, is too big, so I decided to cut on the size to make it um, smaller. That way it would have the same effect or the same triangle effects that a tree has. I thought I was going to leave the tree, the bottom part and the back part with this natural wood color but then I decided to paint the whole thing with the red apple color from Apple Barrel. Now it's time to embellish the Christmas tree. Um, I got this um, wreath and I just took pieces from it and it had the red berries. So I put a piece on top and I put um, pieces on the bottom. Um, but also you can do, like an idea is you can put a star at the top or an angel if you ha have one on hand. And here's the Christmas tree completed. Now let's jump to the second project. I'm gonna do this um, wood hanging signs. All I did is I got these wooden pieces and the uh, words believe in love. I think I got them at Walmart. And all I'm gonna do is, as you can see, um, I painted the wood um, with chalk, Waverly chalk paint. And now I'm gonna paint the words with black um, color from Apple Barrel. This one is super easy to do. All I did is I put the words in the middle and then I took some jute rope that I had on hand and I'm gonna um, wrap on the side of the of the wooden slab because this is what we're gonna use to hang the wooden sign on the Christmas tree.
and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to embellish the sign with the same pieces of the wreath that I used on the first project and I'm just going to put some on the right on the top right and on the bottom left And here are the finished wooden sign. Now let's jump to our third project. The third project is a buffalo plate sign. All I did is I used a gift bag and a 8 by 10 canvas frame. I cut um, one of the sides of the gift bag, especially the sign where it doesn't show when the gift, the gift bag is fold. And this is the piece that I'm going to use. But if you want, you can paint it with chalk paint or any acrylic paint. And I just pasted that um, side of the gift bag that I cut. And I just hot glue it um, on top of the wooden frame. And from the same pieces uh, that I used on the two projects before this one I just embellished the sign so guys as you can see on your top left corner I made another sign using a gift bag that it has the colors um, silver gold and white and I had an 8 by 10 wood frame and I just sprayed, um, painted it with spray paint gold if you don't want to go through all the trouble of painting the frame, just get one gold or like in the video with the red buffalo plate, you can get a black frame. And just insert the piece of the gift bag that you cut and then you have another frame or another sign. Here is the finished sign. Start with our last idea. All I did is I took a candle, an empty candle jar, and I used the same buffalo plate duct tape that I used on the first project, the Christmas tree. And all I did is I wrapped the whole jar with the duct tape. Now I'm going to start with the second um, row of tape. Uh, you need to take in consideration to align the plates on the duct tape, um, the bottom row with the top row. I 
I inserted a foam, the ones that you use for floral arrangement, and I inserted it inside the jar. And now I had um, some jute rope, and all I did is I wrapped it um, on top of the jar, and then I did a little bow. I got this um, ornaments also at, um, no, I think these ones are from Walmart. And all I did is I took the word bright and I put some hot glue and I pasted it on the center of the jar. And here is the Christmas arrangement. Well guys, hope you liked this video. Remember to subscribe and give it a thumbs up. Be safe everyone.